Luke 1, uh, 26 through 38. In the sixth month of Elizabeth's pregnancy, God sent the angel Gabriel to Nazareth, a town in Galilee, to the virgin pledged to be married to a man named Joseph, a descendant of David. The virgin's name was Mary. The angel went to her and said, Greetings, you are highly favored. The Lord is with you. Mary was greatly troubled at these words and wondered the kind of greeting this might be. But the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary. You have found favor in God. You will conceive and give birth to a son, and you are to call him Jesus. He will be great and be called the Son of the Most High. The Lord God will give uh, him the throne to the, his father David, and he will reign over Jacob's descendants forever. His kingdom will never end. Lastly, there is a fifth uh, and final candle, this um, Christ candle. While not all Advent candle wreaths include this additional candle, the center white candle is lit on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, celebrating the arrival that uh, which we have all been anticipating. Jesus is born, and our season of waiting is at an end. With the lighting of the Christ candle, we remember the light which shines in the darkness, the source of our hope, champion for peace, reason for our joy, and giver of love. Let us pray. <clears throat> Lord, on this Christmas Eve, we pause to prepare our hearts for a most beautiful celebration, your birth and coming to earth as our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Clear our minds so we can focus on you and the joy you bring to us through your gift of salvation. May the same thrill and anticipation that filled Mary, the chosen mother of Jesus, consume us and draw us close to you. May our spirits cry out, Alleluia, with the host of angels who first delivered the good news of great joy to humble, awestruck shepherds that night so long ago, the news that would literally one day be heard all around the world. Help us remember and reflect on awesome, on the awesome prophecies foretelling your birth since the beginning of time. Give us faith of, of give us eyes of faith to see on this side of the cross what prophets chose to believe through prof, promises and visions. Emmanuel, God with us, Prince of Peace, the Son of God. Amen. <laughs> 